Hey everybody, this is Fragger and Ray, and we are going to do whatever a spider can in this game. Ah, I get it. We're playing Spider-Man, does whatever a spider time. can, yeah. Mm -hmm. And with some alliteration in the title of Spider Snagger Supreme, I, part dose. I see what they did there, with the S's and the... God, the, God, the almost every single one has alliteration. Well, it's they, ridiculous. They try to be clever. They do. So we're gonna, once again, we're gonna collect all the golden spiders that are hidden, show off the challenge ones, and um, that's about it. I mean, not the challenge ones, the combat ones. The challenge ones I can't show you. Are these the kind of uh, collectibles that benefit you, or are they just thrown in there? Yes. Just, okay, cool. Now, I forgot to mention the first one that we saw there, that's at the second thing you have to turn off. The, like, the generator nuclear power thing that's gonna kill everybody. Oh, one okay, of those. one of those generators. And then that, the other one's at the third one, so there you go. There you go. Whoa, then, lasers. Uh, lasers, yeah. They kind of hurt. Oh, do they? Yeah. Surprised. Shocking, yeah. actually. <laughs> Are there a lot of collectibles uh, in this game? Because I literally know nothing about There's a it. bit. Oh, that's unfortunate. Well, the thing about them is, though, they're fairly easy to find, especially with this guide. Oh, See, I got silver metal there, go. too, Look beating up those dudes. Self-promotion. Exactly. Also, they help you, which is always good. Which is very good. And now we're shifting on to the next level where we play as a 2099 here. hey -o. And uh, punching over that thing there. And, hey, look, there's a golden spider in there. Watch out for that missile. Yeah, watch out. It's bad stuff. Is there like a uh, a level select in this game, or is it all? There's a level select, and it also, in the level select, it tells you in order which ones you may have missed. Well, bam. There you go. It's good to know. So, yeah, it's very good. And they see it there at the entrance, I'm crawling around, and hey, look, I found a spider. Oh, hey, look, a little vent, too. Oh, there's nothing in the vent? Sad there is Actually, the vent you actually have to go into. Oh, okay. I didn't, I didn't show it. What am I going to show, like, five minutes of me running around in vents? That's dumb. Oh, uh, well, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Not going to go there. Um, Then right above that entrance is this one here. Oh, I didn't even notice they're actually like moving spiders. I thought they were just symbols. Nope, they crawl around. Oh, okay. Can they like uh, crawl around and like? Stand? They don't move far. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, because that would be annoying. It would be very annoying. And now we're uh, we're shifting into the next uh, act. This is Act Two, mm -hmm. where um, now uh, Amazing is now in the Twenty Ninety Nine universe and Twenty Ninety Nine is in the Amazing universe. Uh oh, switcheroo! Uh, switcheroo, dude! What the fuck? That looks like the. Uh... Toasty guy from Mortal Kombat. It, it, the first time that happened and he kind of slid in, I went, Toasty! Yeah. Just like, just I couldn't help myself. That would make me shit my pants if I'm just doing my own thing and then that guy just comes out of nowhere. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh, oh you're helping me. Oh. C could you imagine he's like web slinging around for the first time and that happens? That would, just, uh... Just falls. Bricks would be shat. Because I do, uh... Web I bricks. Yeah, web bricks. I don't pay attention that often, so, uh, yeah. Now, this is where it gets a little confusing in this area. Oh, God, he's back. So, at the very bottom, there's this giant open area, probably one of the biggest open areas in the game. You have to, you have to do these three little challenges to get those little that thing right to the right of him, mm -hmm. to pick those things up. The very bottom is a, is a combat one now. When you leave there, swing along the bottom. You can see actually how big this area is. It's uh, quite massive. And it's about six levels high, too. That's unfortunate. Well, no, it's can, fun. Can, can you climb the rock? You can. Okay. Okay. That's and there's also uh, web zipping. You can move really fast in this area. Oh, okay. So then, never mind. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's just it's very big for this kind of a game. Mm -hmm. And now this one took me forever to find. At the very, very top of the level is one. It's good. <laughs> wow. Really? Yeah. Very, very top. Nice. Not joking. I like. Then the very beginning of the next level, you get attacked. <laughs> oh well. Of course. Of course. I like the whole biodome level that you just went yeah. through. That was pretty awesome. Any signs of Polly Shore? No, there was no signs of polish. Sure. There was no trouble in that bubble. Oh, okay. I see what you did there. <laughs> oh, God, that movie. Jesus Christ. So, um, right after that, you see that was a combat uh, one there. Mm -hmm. Open up this thing here, and surprise, surprise. Well, bam, bam. Right there. Yup. See there, every time I pick one up, it gives me health, and it gives me experience orbs, too. That's, uh, that's good. I wish mm -hmm. every collectible you collect did that, instead of uh, bullshit collectibles that just thrown in just to be in there. Yeah. Hey, and then um, I mentioned this, and this is about the newspapers, about mm -hmm. not knowing. Yeah. I've since beaten the game. Yeah. Um, they get you get them automatically, so don't worry about those collectibles. Heard it here. Don't worry about those collectibles. Don't worry about them. You'll be fine. You get them automatically when you start a level and when you beat a level. All right. And what it is, it's like alternate universe of this uh, newspaper from this area and this area. It's oh, kind of okay. neat. Nice little like little Vulture little. starts up a starts up a chicken joint. Not joking. That's one of the newspapers. Chicken joint, huh? It's, yeah. It's pretty hardcore. Yeah, the vulture make a chicken. Yeah, why not? Yeah, he's old and shit. Guy needs money. Yeah, well, I, I don't know why he like runs how many corporations. I, at least he has chicken. Yeah, I think that's true. Now, in the, one of the many, many times you have to beat up a fucking generator. 
Uh, behind that server is that collectible. Bam. Now, these are also confusing. This is one of those areas where you have to do something very quickly. You see in the bottom corner, uh, Amazing might get crushed in a second. Oh, that's bad stuff. Yeah, I see the, the yeah. countdown on the top left. Yeah, so I had to get these very quickly because you literally have to leave this room mm -hmm. before the countdown leaves, and there's three collectibles in this area. Oh, God. So uh, you have plenty of time if you know where they are, and granted, I got all these without knowing where they were. I just kind of moved very, very quickly. There you go. You see how I'm now here on level two? I'm just like, okay, where's the indicator? Because I don't know if you noticed, but there's yeah, an indicator when indicator. you're near one. Mm -hmm. so I'm like, okay, where's this one? Uh, crap, swinging around. Just Gotta you know. find it. Oh, there it is. I found it. Got him. We got him, guys. Boom. So that's it for part two. We still have two more parts left in this guide, but um, Spider-Man. Does whatever a spider can. You know, except for eat bugs. Gross.